Hello, I'm Fawn McNeil Barr, and this is Fawn Studio, my little art gallery and teaching center, and I also do fine framing. And if we go in here, we can see this very large selection of samples for framing. And I have a professional framer that comes in and helps me. She's a master framer from the coast. Her name is Deborah, and she shows me all the ins and outs about making it archival. We use acid-free materials, and we make it uh, where it will age a lot slower than normal and last for years. This is the teaching center, and these are my two main tables here, the length of these two tables. And what I do is I put my easel, I take that easel and I put it here. And I do demonstrations, follow-alongs, and what have you for uh, my adult beginner's classes. The children's classes, I separate the tables, and I put the children all throughout, and they work on their own projects at their own speed. Um, after school classes, summer classes, and then on the walls are some samples of some of the students' work. Those are my teenagers and adults there. This is the art gallery. These are my originals. Most of them are acrylic paintings. I've been painting since I was 12. And uh, some of my older works are in oils. I only have a couple left. This is an older work from Montana, where I'm from. I'm from Libby. This is the Kootenai Falls. And it's an oil. It took me about a year to make that painting. And um, this is a best of show painting. The eyes will follow you as you move around. Uh, he took a best of show in Sebring. He's acrylic, acrylic original. And most of my work's available in print. You can order them online. And, um, I'm just thrilled that I have enough paintings to put all over the walls. <laughs> I never thought I would fill a gallery. I was 12. I was in an abusive home. I, eventually became a foster child and it was my way of escape. It was my way to cope with and deal with the horrible situations that I lived in as a child. And um, stuck with it, loved it, and developed it into more of a, a career. <laughs> yes. I'm with the mural committee and with the art fest committee and I love getting involved with the art fest because the children that take classes from me and of course from the other schools have an opportunity to show what they're learning and doing and that's kind of why I, um, I'm pretty much an advocate for those committees and getting art into the community. I think it's great.